Hi, welcome back. What I want to show you here, now, a few videos ago I showed you how to make a border for your images and I was talking about making an action so that you can just press a button and bang it and do it for you. Now, I've actually made an action here. Where is it? See, I'm always prepared. This is it here and I've called it border black. So if I click border black, press the action, bang. There it goes, and it should save it. And it has saved it. So that's how an action would work. You just click the button, get rid of that now. And it's done the border work for me. So I'd have to keep doing it. And you can run this action in a batch, as a batch. You can do a whole directory full of images and do the borders and quick and easy. So easy as that. So what I want to show you in this video is how to make an action. Okay, what we're going to do now is we're going to create an action for our border um, technique. And I'm going to put it in this folder here, which I've named my actions. So I'm simply going to click um, create new action here. Or you can do it from here, I believe. Whoops. Door here. Where is it? No, I'm in the wrong bit there. There, sorry. Okay, new action. And I'm going to call it um, black border. And again, you can you can say where you want to put it. I'm going to start the recording. Now this only records your keystrokes, so it's not recording the spaces, obviously. It's just recording the keystrokes. So why is this doing that? I can now move this off the screen. Just just ignore that for a minute. So. Let's get started. First thing I need to do is um, change the canvas size. Oops, image size. Percent. I'm going to move through this pretty quick because if you want to see how this is done, you can go back to the other video where I actually show you how I did it. So I'm just going to work through this fairly quickly. Sizing the image down there. Now I need to select the whole image. <coughs> actually, I need to take that off background as well. Now I need to select the whole image. So select all, right click, stroke, four pixels, occupancy, 80%, and color is white. So I'm going to okay that. I'm going to go to select and deselect all now. I'm going to go to images and canvas size. Don't forget you can go back to the other tutorial to see how to make this border. Change that to percent. I'm going to add 5% there, and because I'm dealing with canvas and not the image itself, I'm going to make the bottom bit a bit bigger. OK that. I'm going to come up to Layer, New Fill Layer, Solid Color, don't care what I name it. And OK that. I'm going to make it black. OK. Come over here and move it down, and there's my border all done. Now, in the action, I want it to save. You don't have to do this bit, but I, I, I tend to do it, so I'm just going to do um, save. And I want it saved as a JPEG. And I want to save. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Now, if I go back to the action now, there you go. You see the save command there. I'm going to stop the recording. Now, let's have a look. A brief look at this description here. Look, here's our action image size, set background, set selection. Oh, there's a stroke. Yeah, click these down to see more details on them. Set selection again, canvas size, uh, make fill layer, move current layer, and save. And it's all there. Now, all I need to do, I'm going to go to my history now, click that back to its original state, come back to action. There's my actions, there's my black border, and I'm going to run that. There you go. Easy peasy. Now, play the video back again, and um, pause where you need to pause. If you want to see how to make this border, if you haven't seen that video yet, it's, um, I think it's about two videos back, where I showed you how to make this border, if I was moving too quick. But that's how easy an action is. It simply just records your steps. A tip for you is try not to use shortcuts uh, when you're making an action. Try and use um, the available 
options on the screen because the save makes life a lot easier. So I mean, you can use shortcuts, but I tend to try and do it all longhand when I'm doing a, when I'm doing an action. Anyway, enjoy. <laughs> 